So the detailing video is now here. So I'm gonna do a little walk around of this, of how bad the paint looks. Scratches right there. Barely see my reflection right here. Wheels of fire though. That's faded. The door is needs some loving. Fender, wing. I'm gonna pull the wing off also to get up under the wing because this is damn near impossible to uh, get up under it. But uh, I'm gonna get the to town, start synthetic clay bar in this car. After I'm done doing that, it's stage one of uh, compound. And also the video for that's not done yet. All right, so the clay bar is done. That's the paint. You can see the imperfections in it. You can see Trevor because it's black, but next I'm going to start the, uh, this stuff now with the buffer. Ooh, it's pretty. And uh, that's what it says. But uh, we'll see how it goes with this. This is going to take all fucking night. I just cussed on the video. Alright, so I was making sure like this was going to work. And I did like a little bit of buffing on the front bumper off camera. But uh, here is the buffing off or the, the first stage. But there's the, the bumper done. Trevor's helping me clay pad this side. He's feeling it. And I have music playing. Damn it. Alrighty, so uh, to get every little nook and cranny, we got the, we got the wing off the Trans Am. Dark, Trans -Am. This thing looks so bad. Ew. The wings in the car. Mm. Oh God! Thank God for a wing on these cars. But uh, yeah, the stage one compound is going swell now we just gotta get this clean because i could not wash this hardly at all so uh we're gonna go ahead and start getting this ready for compound two and then start on the wing so we are rolling and then hopefully tonight we'll get some nice pictures of this thing done but uh Get back to work. Um, I'm gonna try to keep put y'all on time lapse here in a second once I get to that side. I don't have a lot of room on this side, so uh, stay tuned. All right, so stage one, the compound is done on the Trans Am. Already noticing a world of freaking difference with this. Would you agree, Trevor? Yep. For a car set for 11 years. And only having the hood really be the main thing that's toasted. Not too freaking shabby. But I am actually hating this because this kind of sucks. But seeing a reflection in a nice deep black car is kind of nice. I'm not going to lie. Alright, so this polish is turning out freaking beautiful. This paint is coming back black. There's a few scratches here and there, but I mean, it's just 11 year old paint, but damn, she's looking good. And no, I really don't know what I'm doing here. 
but I've watched a lot of YouTube videos on it and I feel pretty confident and I'm pretty sure the results are showing that I'm doing it somewhat right. But just, just look at that. Look, look at Trevor's reflection. You see two of him. Ooh, this is this is spicy. This is pretty this is pretty freaking spicy. And then tomorrow I'll wash all the the wax and the crevices out because I missed a bunch, but it doesn't really matter. So hope you guys are enjoying this little step-by-step -step process. And look at that reflection, boy. Can't even tell. No, it's just me right there. ladies and gents so it got late last night but the hood didn't come out because i didn't try the hood I, I attempted at the hood and it didn't work so the, the hood painted to get this car looking like 100 percent presentable but uh here she is in the sunlight looking much better than it was There's still ha it still had its imperfections in it and whatnot, but I, mean, I still got to actually like get deeper on the back bumper, you know, it's now dusty. Um, but yeah, this was a fun little process, I guess, to put it in a nice way. And also, I still got to fix that. But now that this car is clean, I can do the funnier video I want to do. Because I wanted to make sure it was clean and presentable and you know. Also, main reason why I did this now is to get it ready for the F-Body Beach Bash in October. That I'm planning on attending in this car. I've already got my hotel and everything done for it. But yeah this is uh here's the trans am get that, yeah. get that reflection going with the wheels i still gotta fix that camber also i can't forget to do that but we are still a long way from this car being uh how i want it to where i won't have to spend money on it i can just make cooler videos with it instead of like working videos because I still got my G8 to do and then next is the Firebird which is more of the build process things because it's kind of, this car is kind of out of the build process besides me having to take the trans out to fix the rear seal but uh I hope you guys enjoyed it and uh thanks for the support and I'll see you guys on the next one deuces